Okay, she is in the house and she is absolutely stunning. And voila, the finished product. It looks very nice. Thank you. I have to tidy up the ground a little bit, but it's done. Oh, it looks nice in the dark. <laughs> Good night, my dumplings. <laughs> <laughs> all right so let me give a little quick tour of the tree for those who are not familiar i think we could definitely put a few more ornaments on so it's really good i tried to keep it silver white a little bit of blue and a little bit of brown mostly brown because of my owls so let me show you the owls so we have this little hooter i think he looks cool because he looks like a little pine cone this is a classic one, love this one. Oh, this one's so cute. I feel like he goes really well with the aesthetic. This one was a gift and he's very, very cute with his little hat. Speaking of cute hats, I think I actually got this one in Aruba recently. Um, so that's really cute. I don't remember where I got this one, but this is the ornament that Peter put on, the only one of the entire tree. Here's a little friend of the other one. Very, very cute. My friend made me this one. Love. <laughs> I got this one at Bryant Park. I remember because it was very funny an owl with the really long legs because technically they actually have really long legs so <laughs> now this owl makes a lot more sense look at this fun one and yeah so the other ones are just kind of all just some random decor you know just like silver and balls and stuff So for the stairway, I put this garland up that wraps around. I got this from Target and I'm kind of unsure how I feel about it. I like, feel like it looks a little sloppy. And then I got these little baby little trees to put 
on the little steps, which actually I love. The little basket things go really cute with the floor, and I love walking up the stairs and looking at the trees. So those are really cute. So it's super dark where we live, so I wanted to go all out on some lights. Well, <laughs> this isn't all out, but it's a start. So I just did some lights on some of the bushes and then some candles in the windows. Okay, so here's the little haul. So I felt like the tree needed a few more just like basic little pieces. So I got some of these just like little basic things from Target. These nice little things to just like kind of hang around just to add a little bit more flair. And then I like these clear things. Technically these are like DIY and you like paint them. I got them from Michaels, but I feel like they look like big bubbles and I feel like they're kind of fun. So I got those. I love putting fake flowers in the tree. I think it just like adds a really nice touch. So I got two new ones. I already have a few in there. No, I already have a few in the tree. So I wanted to add a few more. And then I got some cute little ornaments. Obviously I got a new little owl for this year. I feel like this is a different one, not like one that I have. I'm all about these little gnomes this year. I don't know why I'm so obsessed, but I love it. I thought this went really well with the motif. Again, a little motif. And I love ballet, and I saw these at Michael's. So I got these at Michael's. These other ones were all at Target. They're all like $3 or $2. And I thought these were so cute. I got a tree topper from Target for the tree. Um, these are really nice because you can put it like on the stick thing, I think, and we don't really have a star, so I think this will be really, really pretty on the tree. And I got a few more little lights from Target. These were literally $2 or $3 um, to just kind of put in the kitchen, I think. I just want to like put some more lights around. And then I got a wreath. I cannot wait to show you this, a new wreath for inside. And I got this little wreath hook. This little wreath hook, no, <laughs> this little wreath hook is um, like marble actually, so it's actually kind of cute. Okay, let's get decorating. The wonders of life got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree Glimmering light, I am right where I want to be I'll be home for a couple of days Wander around with you You and me in the cold, thought it'd never be true Wherever I go, I got you Oh, I have stopped running, there is no way trying You better loosen your belt Drinking out wine by the fire Don't care of anything else It's Christmas And some kind of love I really love the way the tree is coming together These little flowers I think look really pretty And then our tree topper She looks a little crooked I have to fix that But Super cute, the little shoes. My favorite, I love these little like sprinkles. They look like icicles coming from the tree and they're like a light shade of pink and they're so beautiful. Okay, I definitely have to fix this. Okay, I decided to take off the tree topper. <laughs> this one spot keeps annoying me whenever I'm on camera. It literally doesn't, 
annoy me otherwise. I don't know why. There's just like some areas that are, anyway. I might fill this in more. I still didn't put in, I didn't put these things on yet. So I might do that in a little bit. Um, honestly, the prices for these things were really, really good. All of these were all like $3. All the little ones that I got, these were like three. And this whole thing of all these little icicles was like $5. So it's really, really cute. And now for the grand reveal, I got a wreath and I put it above our fireplace. And yes, honestly, I think it looks stunning. I'm so, so happy with it. Okay, check it out. Look at the wreath. It's literally so perfect. It goes with our white green like aesthetic so, so well. I got this at Michael's. It was like $40. So it's like the same price as all of the other ones at Target. It's marked for like $100, but then it's like 60% off. So like don't get turned off by how much the wreaths are there. They're actually all like normal price. And I think this looks really, really cute. I love the whole vibe. The whole like white green vibe here. It looks so good. Lazy peaches. So I ended up updating the mantle a little bit here. I'm still kind of like doing a work in progress. This is like what keeps me busy and sane throughout life. So I got like a little gnome. This little tree is from HomeSense. This is from Pottery Barn. And this is from Pottery Barn. I might move this because I feel like it's kind of out of place. I just got it, but I don't know. And then my prize possession freaking stockings. These are so, so freaking cute. I love them so much. They're so soft and they're so aesthetic. I love it so much. So they're from Pottery Barn. These two are the same and then this one is different. So this is gonna be Peter's, uh, Nala, and my stocking. I tried to have them embroidered, but I was having issues online and I'm like, you know what, it's fine. Like, we'll deal with that some other time. Um, but I love them, I think they're perfect. And I put them off to the side, but I don't know, it might change. And then I added this little guy, how cute is he? I don't know why I have this like little obsession with the little gnomes and I think he looks so cute holding onto his little candy cane and like I picked the most aesthetic gnome like I am so obsessed with this little corner he makes me so happy whenever I see it so love that all right guys so now for today's Christmas decorating continuing um, I'm going to wrap some presents to put under the tree they're gonna be basically fake presents and I'm gonna take you along that so what I basically did was just grabbed some boxes and stuff that I had from deliveries and everything. We recycle everything, so I just haven't had a chance to break these down yet. But I tried to just pick some smaller ones that'll be good for under the tree. I have all of my wrapping paper here. And then some of this tape so I can close the boxes since they're all open. And then this tape for the wrapping paper. I also got a cookie for a snack later, and some scissors and some water. So, let's get started. So that's some of the decorations that we've done so far. I'm probably gonna do more because I'm obsessed and I really don't have anything else to do with my life nowadays because I'm at home all the time. But that's the tree. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys like coming along this whole little journey of Christmas decorating. To be honest, I've kind of always 
decorated and I've been really into Christmas my whole life. Even if it didn't always look like that, I've always made sure to have a tree for so long. I've had all of these like Christmas decorations and a fake tree and gift wrap and all that stuff in my New York City small apartments every year I've always had them um, so now I get to really feel like I get to go all out on everything with the, the new house that we have and everything so it's really really fun really exciting anyway I hope you guys had fun thanks again for stopping by please remember to subscribe to my channel I'm trying to get 500 subscribers by the end of the year um, December 31st if I do it early maybe I'll do a little like giveaway or something because it'll be a really big goal for me Anyway, I hope you guys see you guys next time. Like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram.